Is generator power safe for electronics? A common question when dealing with electrical appliances is, is generator power safe for electronics? Are you worried about how electricity from your generator can affect your electronics? Before charging your devices, it is important to know if the power produced by a generator is safe for them. This article looks at some simple steps you can take to ensure your devices are safe when charging from a generator. We think it is a good idea to know the basics about generator safety and how to use them safely, during running your computers or televisions on generators. What is a generator? A generator is a machine that converts mechanical energy into electrical energy. It can be used to power any electronic device from a simple fan to an entire house. In the simplest form, it uses a motor and some gears or shafts which rotate as they turn electric current through them. The electricity, AC power, is then fed into a wire which is connected to an electrical outlet. How does generator power work? A generator uses mechanical energy, or kinetic energy, to convert it into electricity. This can be done by spinning the shafts of the machine at high speeds while it runs on gasoline or diesel fuel. The rotor will create a magnetic field, which in turn will cause the current to flow through it. How do I know if my generator is safe? It is important to ensure that your generator's electrical output is safe for electronics before using it to charge devices. You should check your generator by looking at its circuit breaker or fuse. If you do not see one, there is no way to know if the generator has an electrical output safe for electronics. What is the difference between generator power and regular power? The regular power slash national grid power provides constant electricity whereas generators are used in a backup slash emergency situation. The main difference between generator power and regular power is that generators can be used in emergency situations. In a situation where there is an outage or if the national grid goes down, you will need to use your generator to charge your devices. In order for you to have enough electricity for all of your devices, you will need to have a generator. If you do not already have one, you should get a generator that is made of heavy-duty materials and has enough capacity for your home. This way, it will be able to supply electricity when needed. What are the pros of using generator power? There are a lot of benefits to using generator power. One of the biggest benefits is that you will be able to have electricity in case there is an outage or when the national grid goes down. The fact that it can supply your devices with enough energy during an emergency situation makes it a must-have for anyone who wants to be prepared. What are the cons of using generator power? The main disadvantage of using generator power is that it takes up a lot of space. You will need to have enough room for the generator and all of its components, such as the battery and fuel tank. If you do not have enough space in your home, you may need to consider getting an extension cord for your generator. Sometimes, generator power fluctuations and distortion can be bothersome. Why generator power is safe for electronics? There are many benefits to using generator power, but there is one big benefit that everyone should know about. The main reason why it is safe for electronics is that the new feature of particular generator power generators, is that they are safer for electronics. They have a fixed RPM system, so they can generate a constant voltage which is very important for electronics. However, the new inverter generator can produce clean electricity slash clean energy, which is totally safe for electronics devices. However, you can also take some precautions during using generator power. What are the basic safety precautions when using generator power? Use a surge protector. A surge protector is a device that protects electronic devices from power surges. There are many types of surge protectors, but they all have the same purpose. They help to prevent damage caused by sudden voltage spikes and currents. It can be a little expensive, but it is very important for safety reasons. 
If you are using generator power for your house, then it is necessary to have a surge protector. Keep in mind that if the voltage drops too low or rises too high, then all of your electronics will be damaged. The best way to prevent this from happening is by installing a surge protector. Never use a generator without a power cable. The only way to keep your electronics safe is by using a surge protector and keeping the voltage constant. This will help you prevent damage from occurring on your electronics. Keep in mind that if you have a portable generator, then it may not have a built-in surge protector. In this case, you should get a power cable and put it on the side of your generator. Keep all electrical equipment away from the area where you are using the generator. It is very important to keep all electronic devices at least 30 feet away from any metal objects or tools. You can also get a power cable to connect your generator to the wall outlet, but you should still keep 30 feet away from any metal objects or tools. Add a surge arrester. If you are using a portable generator, then it is very important to add a surge arrester. It will help to prevent damage from occurring on your electronic devices like laptop, mobile etc. You can purchase a surge arrester that attaches directly to the generator. In order for this device to work properly, it needs to be plugged into a surge protector. If you do not have one, then it is best to get one and plug it in. You can also purchase an inverter or power strip that has a built-in surge arrester. Use an uninterruptible power supply UPS device. If you are going to be using your generator for a long period of time, then it is best to get an uninterruptible power supply. The main reason why this is important is because your generator may not have enough juice to keep the devices on your home running if there was a blackout. This will help your electronics stay on during a blackout. It may also be beneficial for the grid to stay online in case of an emergency. You can also purchase a surge protector and plug it into the power strip. It is very important to use an uninterruptible power supply if you are going to be using your generator for more than 4 hours in one day. You can also get a battery backup system that will keep your sensitive electronics running even if the power goes out. Add a transfer switch and circuit breaker. If you are going to be using your generator for more than 4 hours in one day, then it is best to add a transfer switch and circuit breaker. The main reason why this is important is that if there was an emergency, you would not be able to turn off your generator. If you do not have a transfer switch and circuit breaker, then it is best to get one. What are the most popular generator power generators? There are a lot of different brands and models of generator power generators, but there are a few that stand out as being the best. One brand is Honda, which has created an efficient electric start system for its generators called the PX series. Another brand is Generac which has created MP series generators for its customers to choose from. How to use generator power safely. You should be careful when using generator power, because it can be dangerous if you do not know how to operate it properly. Here are some safety tips that you need to follow. Make sure the unit is turned off before connecting any power devices. If you are not sure if the unit is turned off, Check to see that it has no power in its circuit breaker. Make sure all connections between your device and the generator are secured properly before powering on any of them. Do not use extension cords to connect your device with the generator. If you are using an extension cord, make sure that it is certified for generator power. Nowadays, many people have started using generator power because they want to save electricity and reduce their carbon footprint at the same time. However, you need to be careful when using generator power and follow the safety tips mentioned above if you want to use it safely. Conclusion? In summary, as long as you know the basics about generator safety and how to use them safely, your devices will be safe from generator power. During a power outage, you can use your standby generator to power up some of your appliances and devices that require electricity. Just make sure that you follow the safety tips mentioned above. 
The Generator Safe Tips will help you protect your devices from generator power in your whole house and the power source will be available to you when the power goes out.